Hello, YouTube. All right. Time for a bit more Fallout 4. My plan right now is to just kind of work on Sanctuary, get it going a little bit more. You know, figure out everything I want to do. Okay, got 12 food, 9 water. Uh... Honestly, it probably wouldn't hurt to have a... Uh... Hmm. That's the arc. Honestly, it feels like pop like a heavy machine gun turret, like huh. maybe like around there. Twelve twenty four, and I. I definitely want to keep this safe, so pop that there. Minimum patrol. Okay, perfect. All right, let's uh, finish scrapping this all up. All right, in your opinion, in uh, chat, in your opinion, should I swap these around and have like my name big on here, and then all the subscribers on here? on the marquees. What do you think? Oh. Nice. Hey. There we go. I'm just trying to clear out this place completely. I get angry at my cousin Bessie like when my cousin came over and said he got to clean the dishes like excuse me and then I gave him the eye that my best cousin said got attitude I don't have attitude well sometimes if you get me angry well yeah everyone can get attitude
Okay, I think we have officially... I'm just trying to clear out all the... All the scrapping. to give me good combinations for what there we go for food I'm all ears getting somewhere. I'm mainly just trying to clear out as much of sanctuary as I can. Okay, I don't think I can scrap that. <laughs> Popcorn, butter, and honey? Yeah, egg and rice. Milk. <laughs> Milk and cookies is a great combo I never would have guessed. Okay then, buddy. You keep doing what you're doing. It needs to be working for you. Yes, sir. There we go. Give me... Oh. 
Come on. Sweet. Easy screws, all the toy cars. Hmm. Oh, oh, hi. Yes? <clears throat> so what's your story? Looking to trade, rob me, or just ask directions to Diamond City? Uh... Let's see what you've got. I have a little bit of everything. Alright, trash can Carla. I can tell a little bit of everything. Unfortunately. I no problem, Carla. All right. All right, got my power armor all decked out. Actually, where's Preston? Yeah. Joan. Hello. What's up? Uh, where's your boss? Preston. Okay, that's all for now? Oh, nice.
That's kind of annoying. Okay, that works. <laughs> Your brand says we're in life too fuck you. It's MSA, not the real life. I don't know what MSA is. Top over here, quick. There we go. I guess I'll go there, toss down a couple of uh, turrets. Oh, shit. Oh, shit, 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 shit. Okay, this is going to be the only place you all are, so. There we go. All right, good stuff, good stuff.
Yeah. Hey, what's up? Radio, you're actually scared of spiders. Bye. All right. See ya. Get over to Ten Pines. Does not have a workbench? No. Oh yeah, I have to get, uh, travel shit over here. Hmm. You? I, I don't know you. Just keep your... Myrna. Keep away from my stall. I don't know you. Alright, fuck you. Today's Halloween, but do we get treats? No, it's all tricks all day. Gotta pick me up if you're feeling glum. Good. I'll take a look, sure. Kim's for a balanced lifestyle. Yeah. Something bad went down in the old museum of witchcraft up near Salem. Why would anyone even go there? It's been abandoned forever. Hmm. Hey, I'd rather be on this side of the tracks on the other side. You know? Perfection for sale. Hand pulled pieces. You then. You need a genuine, authentic, custom made hickory swatter. Hey, you're the new guy, right? Yeah, I'm the new guy. Well, it's good to have you here. Name's Arturo Rodriguez. If you need protection, let's talk. So you know weapons, huh? Listen, I can sell you guns, swords, whatever. And they'll keep you alive for sure. But the real secret is in the mind. 
a little personal touches, install a scope, expand the clip size, whatever. You spend time with your gear, and you'll have the right answer to every problem. Anyway, let's get back to you and what kind of protection you need. I've got a few minutes to browse. Let's see what you got. To test the grip. Oh, big boy. Damn. A legitimate medical concern. Is it about a facial reconstruction service? Could use some supplies, actually. All right, but go easy on the Ken. Mm. Septic gas. All right. Well, let's go talk to Piper. Dweller? I know you're not wearing your blue jumpsuit right now, but the pit boy and that fish out of water look get divorced. So here's the deal I want an interview. Your life story in print. I think it's time down the city had a little help side perspective on the Commonwealth. You do that, and uh, I'll tell you what I'll come with you. Watch your back while you get used to the world above ground. Uh. What kind of interview is this going to be? I ask you who you are, get your opinion on life out there, and maybe load up a few tough questions. And get to I'm about to, as soon as I find Preston, I'm going to go help another settlement. How's it going, Ski Man? All right, Piper. I'm in. Good. I came. Down to business. All right. So I know you're from a vault. Stretch. How would you describe your time on the inside? Family and I were frozen. I didn't spend much time in the vault. Wait, what? <sighs> they boxed you up in a fridge? The whole time? Are you saying you were alive before the war? Yeah. The war? Which war? The one that gave us this lovely landscape of demolished buildings and nuclear radiation every ten feet? You're telling me you saw everything before they blasted it into pieces? Yeah. Yes. I'm over 200 years old. Oh my god. The man... How's it going, Ski Man? So, you've seen the Commonwealth, Diamond City. How does it compare to your old life? Uh, I'm gonna be honest. You're all living in rusty shacks, killing each other. Oh my god, no. Okay. Well, that's gonna be a fun one to quote. Now, the big question. You came all I'm at way. Nintendo and GameStop right now. Why? What happened? Who is it? I lost family, okay? I'm trying to get one of them back. What's their name, Blue? Who are they? My son, Sean, was kidnapped. He's not even a year old parent after the missing child as heartbreaking today as it ever was tell me do you suspect the institute's involved yep yeah, but who the fuck is the institute the institute 
Who are they? That blue is the biggest mystery in the Commonwealth. No one really knows who or where they are, but their handiwork is all over. Synths. Synthetic people. Sent from their hidden labs to do... Oh yeah, I did run into some of them. Sometimes they even replace a person with a synth double. A little covert agent no one would ever suspect. Now, not everything that goes wrong has the Institute behind it, but... The problem is these cool little slipcovers for the new Paper Mario game to make the case look like a GameCube game and they didn't have it today and apparently it's only for Canada. Oh, damn. That sucks. They make synthetic people? That's right. There are two major kinds you have to watch out for. The first is an obvious fake. Skin looks like plastic. Skeleton might even be showing. You see groups of them collecting, scouring the collecting GameCube shit is my thing. That's why I'm big mad. Ah, uh, dang. How much would it cost to get something extra shipped? Whole town got cleaned out. The second type of synth is the real deal, with skin, blood, warm smiles, and guilty glances, just like a good old-fashioned human. So, do you think they could be involved? The Institute or one of their agents? When you say collecting GameCube shit, are you like a completionist? Like, are you like mint condition? Or is it like you want to just collect the games you loved from your childhood kind of thing? A man took Sean, not some shadowy brute. I hope that's true. Because if they are involved, everything gets worse. For the last part of our interview, I'd like to do something different. I want you to make a statement to Diamond City directly. The threat of kidnapping is all but ignored in the Commonwealth. Everyone wants to pretend it just doesn't happen. What would you say to someone out there who's lost a loved one but might be too scared or too numb to the world to look for them? Wait, people just ignore kidnappings out here? <laughs> yeah, Blue, if you haven't noticed, you grow up in the Commonwealth and eventually someone is going to get taken. Maybe not someone you try to know, get but someone. And people just Cherry and box everything. I don't own any sealed games, but you have a lot. Attacks or super mutants or feral ghouls. You just give up. So I want my readers to hear what keeps you going. Maybe they'll find a little inspiration. Now, what would you like to say? No matter how much you want to give up, don't. Have to have hope that you'll see them again. Okay, uh, or just so I know, CIB is cherry in box, everyone. right? Thanks. That's everything. It's gonna take some time to put this all together, but all I right. think your story is gonna give Diamond City plenty to talk about. Anyway, I agreed to come with you, right? Complete in box. Oh, yeah. Just say the word when you're ready. I can't wait to see where this story goes next. Hey, I think, uh, Oh shit. Wow, you warp. I'm not gonna take your stuff. Yeah, I was looking at, uh, I think it was like not price value, price chart. And I put up, I did a kind of a setup of my, some of my old games. And I'm like, oh, I didn't realize they were worth that much. Do you have any holy grails of stuff you just, you're hoping to find or hoping to get? Snazziest thing I have is either the Game Boy Player or Pokemon XD with the pre-order poster. Nice, good job. Yeah, cause uh, Game Boy player kept from my childhood. Yeah, apparently I have a uh, a collection that's actually very hard to come by, but it's for PlayStation Two. If you're familiar with the Xeno uh, Saga series, apparently I. Owning all three is very rare, especially if all three are like complete in box. Uh, 
Apparently, I think it's the one of them is worth like 200 something. I was just more like, cool. Eventually, I'll sell it. Hey, Dick Waffle. Bye. All right, out with it. What's your game? Give me a break. I can't win with you. Win? This isn't a contest. I'm just trying to understand what you're doing here. You're not the military type. You're a loner. So I can't figure out why you're sticking around. You got what you wanted, so why don't you hit the road? You want me to be legit? The Brotherhood might be the best chance I'll ever have to find my son. Well, as far as reasons go, that's a pretty good one. Yeah, no shit. Look, I'm going to cut you some slack because Dance trusts you. But if you step out of line and put any of my brothers or sisters in danger, I'll make sure you regret it. So, ready for your assignment, hero? Pokemon XD was my big chaser, but a sealed Zelda or Resident Evil game I want to buy whenever I get rich. What's your opinion on game grading, like slabbing games? Ready. Then listen up. Like it or not, one of our most important duties is to keep the Commonwealth clear of the trash. I'm talking about mutants, ghouls, synths. The abominations the damn eggheads caused when they started playing with their toys. This op is simple. I'm going to send you to a target, and you're going to terminate everything that calls it home. Okay. The details you need are right here. Don't come back until the job's done. Clear out College Square. I was hoping to see you again. Ready to recover another piece of tech? You don't like slabs? Affirmative. Perfect. I mark the location on your map. Stay alert. Okay. You don't like slabs and are you well I'll put it this way. Are you against grading in general or you just put it someone wants to slab their shit and put it on their nerd shelf and not resell it? That's super fine. Yeah, okay, that's where me and you are we're on the same wavelength. I have nothing against slabbing. I'm against the speculative market. I'm against people who are trying to literally flip games for a quick buck. That sh that shit irritates me. Wait. Okay, I do have the right. Yeah, for all right. Like, but the people who literally want to like get like pay the extra for say, uh, you know, a ten out of ten copy of Super Mario sixty four, but their goal is to why do they want it? Because they want to display it. Because you know it helped. It helped Super Mario 64 help them get through some tough times or that kind of shit. You know, some people have nostalgia for that kind of thing. I would take that. Like for me, uh, okay. I'd say for the vessel, that game would probably be like Final Fantasy IX. Motherfucker. Alright. And then we have the shit all company DK oldies. That's fucking... My biggest issue with DK Oldies is 
the fact that they are overcharging for every possible fucking possible like everything that that's oh hi There we go. I just, I just, I hate the speculative market in general. Cause it's, hey, my biggest, oh, uh, point blank. They have no passion for gaming. They don't care about gaming. They're trying to just make another quick buck. Tubs full of real Pokemon cartridges. I think DK Oldies overcharges and you know that can and uh, doesn't put out the best quality stuff. But you know, at least. My biggest thing is they're also not trying to like uh, jump into this uh, like a speculative market. Simply play, yeah. It's why emulation is a thing. For example, like. There we go. Got it. Like, say I wanted to play uh, an old, perfect, hey, an old uh, Pokemon game that the vessel played back in the day. You know how much it would cost for me to get a functioning copy of, say, Pokemon Gold? Or fucking God forbid, you know, you know, a Game Boy Color with a uh, block was one. There we Plate. go. Nope. I do not bother activating protect drums. That was just three big old shots of fuck you. It's floating hand, floating hand. I'm just waiting for the fuckers to crawl out. Hello. Goodbye.
a I just put the barrel to his brain. Damn, they really tried to set up down here. And then the ghouls just went fucking hog wild. Dog meat, you scared the shit out of me. Did I miss something else over here? No, oh, I can pop out there. Sleep for an hour. Ooh, antifreeze. Yes, please. What do we got? What do we got? Alright, next level I get local leader. Because that'll just be for the protected tree. Look at Cherry. All the adhesive. Hmm. OK. 
Okay, and I think we're good. Wait. Oh, I think I already opened the thing that required. Or I didn't. Oh, I did. <laughs> eh, at least I got to use it. Yeah, I just went into there. Hey, uh, Ski Man, how much do you know about this game? Hey Nicole, it's my most played game, but really haven't truly really enjoyed it since. Uh, one sec, I will, there we go. I have a couple of questions. I just, I'll ask them when I'm not being fucking hunted by feral ghouls. Knock, knock. Okay, okay. Hello, Sergeant. Hey, what's up? And hey, Nicole. Sorry if I didn't say it before, but welcome in. Hope you're doing well. I cannot pass. Now oh, it's literally right there. Okay. As for most video game hours, I have recorded Fallout 4 wins, but I probably played more New Vegas than Smash Brothers, to be honest. That's fair, that's fair. Alright. About time you showed your face. I take it that area is clear? Affirmative. Keep it up, and I may start believing you got some real guts. Yeah. Recon's always coming in. Whenever you're ready for another op, you know where to find me. I'm not ready. Right. I better not catch you screwing around when there's work to be done out there. Hey. And you want some? Me. Help with the recon team. But uh, my question, now that I finally remember, how do I make it to make uh, supply lines between uh, two places? Like, do I send someone? Video game with the most hours for you is Terraria with 705, then follow New Vegas with 619. Jesus, nice. You have the perk i believe i do because i just that's a local leader right 
or do I need yeah, uh, or do I need it to be rank two? But uh, establish supply lines. Okay, so no, so that's what I need. How do I go about doing that? Do I have to like, like go in here, select someone, and then just send their ass off? Oh. Oh, and oh, before I forget, Nicole, since you are subbed, I will ask if, would you like your name added to the sub wall in Fallout 4? Find it from a settler with no task should be an option to set up a supply line. Uh, the only... Is there any way to take someone off a task? Oh, wait, wait, I see it, I see it. Uh, confirm. Okay. There we go. That would be cool. Okay, cool. Uh, if that's the case, give me one second. You love making supply lines with robots. Uh, I believe it is decorations. Nope, it wasn't power. Okay, my second one is what is what color would you like it to be? White, red, orange, yellow, green, blue, or purple? Purple is your favorite color? All right. Ah, God damn it, I'm a dumbass. I keep forgetting to move over. Uh, 
All right, there we go. Nicole, welcome to the sub wall. Eventually I may fix this up, but for now, anyone who, I will say this, anyone who subscribes on Twitch will get their name on the sub wall. If, if requested, that is the biggest thing. Some people don't want that kind of recognition, which is fine. 